Hi, this is Adrian from Oddswiz, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to read and how to navigate uh, through the stats uh, displayed by Oddswiz in uh, the graphical view mode. Uh, we're going to look at a game between Tottenham and Arsenal, and at the top, you can see the teams, uh, statistics that uh, Oddswiz is offering, attack force, defense strength, and shape or stamina or current form, let's say. Uh, below that, you have the odds, according to some bookmakers, along with uh, their corresponding chances. 198 is corresponding to a 40% chance uh, for a Tottenham win, and 3.8 is corresponding to 25% chance of a draw, and 3.52 is corresponding to a 27 chance of Arsenal win. Below this uh, informational panel, you have the actual stats displayed in a graphical mode. Uh, by default, you will see that this game, the current game, is highlighted. And if you move mouse over each of the games, other games will be highlighted. At the top of each table, you see the results of previous games. Depending on the package uh, that you subscribe to, a different number of games will appear. For the free package, you will have access to the only eight uh, the last games. But I'm using uh, the greatest package and I'm accessing 20 games. The colors uh, represent the a result, orange is a draw, red is a loss, and green is a win. Mouse over the results and you will see the actual score. Below this, you have the statistics, attack, defense, and shape. And the bars represent the difference between uh, Tottenham and the opponent during that team. And if you mouse over each game, you will see the actual numbers. So in this case, Tottenham has an attack of uh, 89 and the opponent was an attack of 36. If the bars are moving upward, then it means that uh, the team in question, in this case Tottenham, was stronger in that uh, statistic. So in this case, it was stronger in uh, defense. But here, where he placed against Burnley, he was actually uh, worse in terms of uh, defense. The same goes here. You can see the shape here. The, sh the shape uh, Tottenham was in better shape. Here it was in worse shape than Arsenal. Uh, as you see, when you mouse over a game on this side, another game is highlighted on the other side. And the way the, the other match is highlighted is uh, based on a different criteria. So for example, here I'm uh, highlighting a game against West Ham. And the system will try to find a game against West Ham that was played by Arsenal. This way, you will be able to see how two teams uh, performed against the same team. And you would be able to make more informed decisions about your bets. If there is no team, uh, no, no corresponding team, on the other side, it will show you the match with the lay with the, the same index so if i were to highlight the uh, second game uh, the second most recent game and there wasn't a, a similar game with the same team it will highlight the second uh, most recent game uh, at the top of the of this table you will see that there is a checkbox uh, that can allow you to filter the games of the same type this means that on the Tottenham side, it will show only matches played at home. And on the Arsenal side, it will show only matches played away. And this is what happens when you click on it. In this case, there will be, uh, for example, here, uh, Tottenham played against Stoke. And because Arsenal didn't play away against Stoke, it doesn't highlight on the other side a game against Stoke. It actually highlights a game sixth most recent uh, away game which was against southampton now i'm i'm checking and now uh, you'll see the all the games another option in this uh, top part of the table is the ability to sort the games by default they are sorted by date but you can sort them based on a uh, game similarity so you can sort by attack similarity and this means that the games will be sorted based on how similar they are in terms of attack so in this case this is the current game and i'm getting displayed games that are similar and further away are games that are less similar than the current game i can also sort by defense similarity and the same thing happens it will show uh, matches that 
are similar in this regard. Same goes with uh, sort by shape or current form. You see that I'm getting uh, matches that are similar in how the opponents fared against each other on those particular games. If I go back and sort by date, uh, if you scroll down, you will see that below these uh, statistics, you are getting radar chart, which displays detailed information about that specific game. In this case, for example, uh, it's the previous game between Tottenham and Arsenal. The green polygon is uh, corresponding to the reference team, which is Tottenham in this case, and uh, the gray polygon is corresponding to the opponent. Here, the, you see more statistics. You see the shape that you also see above, but the attack and defense is uh, split by uh, first and second half. Below the radar chart, you see the odds and their corresponding uh, result chances. Based on how the the shape of the and the size of the polygon, you are able to gouge exactly how different are those teams in terms of their strength and weaknesses. In this case, it seems that the teams are similar in uh, terms of uh, uh, strength with a bit of difference in, in the favor of Arsenal in terms of shape and second half defense. I think that's about it for uh, the presentation of the graph statistics from Ozzy's. Please check out the other video about the table view. Have a nice day.